But first, we're learning more tonight about a youth coach arrested for trying to seduce young boys online. It's a story Eyewitness News first broke yesterday live at 5. 41-year-old Anthony De Silva was arrested yesterday by Massachusetts police and has now been turned over to authorities in Florida for allegedly trying to solicit sex from a 16-year-old boy. And tonight, we're hearing from the suspect's mother who was there when her son was arrested by police. Eyewitness News reporter Nathan Nuosu is live in our studio now with the latest developments. Well, Jennifer and Mike, the mother of that hockey coach, says he cried as he was being taken away. She says she's still shocked by the allegations. I didn't even have anything like that on my mind. The mother of a Massachusetts junior hockey coach charged with soliciting sex from teenage boys was there when her son was arrested. I just can't believe it. I haven't slept in two days. 41-year-old Anthony Tony De Silva was charged with 10 counts of using a computer to seduce a child and one count of transmission of material harmful to a child. De Silva is a coach for the Massachusetts Maple Leafs, a club team made up of players aged 16 to 20 years old. He's good with the kids, you know, like these yeah. younger ones, because they can, some of them are smaller than others, you know. Yeah. but. The kids all liked him. We're going to take you to jail. The mother of a 16-year-old boy in Polk County, Florida, contacted police when she believed De Silva was talking to her son on Facebook. Detectives then got permission to pose as the teen online. After the officers took over, De Silva sent nude photos of himself and described sexual acts. He also began chatting with a second Polk County boy at the time, whom detectives began to impersonate as well. De Silva was arrested at his accushionate home Wednesday night. The Bristol County DA's office tells us De Silva is now in the custody of Florida law enforcement. He was crying when he left, though. The last time he left, he was crying. And they were, you know, putting him in. And I said, Jesus, this is horrible. The Bristol County DA's office is involved in the investigation. Right now, they say it doesn't appear De Silva had any local victims, and he doesn't have a criminal record in Massachusetts. Nika Nuosu, Eyewitness News.